Hey, what's going on, y'all? I'm here to talk about this video that was posted on my page by two friends of mine, uh, Aaron and, and Sandra. It's a What Would You Do series about uh, basically interracial relationships and how people view it. In this video, in this episode of What Would You Do, it was a black barber female and a black male customer who happened to have a white girlfriend. Uh, the white girlfriend entered the, into the barber shop and then the black girl just went off on the um, black male. Now, this kind of behavior I typically see on different kind of uh, Facebook pages I'm part of. I mean, I hear these same words echo time and time again. You know, you weak, you a sellout, you know, you couldn't find you a strong black woman. Why would you be with her? They can't understand us, this, that, and the third. I really don't get that. I really don't understand why people have to feel that way. You know, I don't know why people just can't let two people love who they want to love. You know, and I mean that just doesn't stop in interracial relationships either. That goes for the gay couples too. You know, they they over here with their own fight, just trying to get married. Who who really cares? Let them guys get married. But back back to the topic I'm talking about here with this um with this uh episode that I seen. There were three total people. I mean, well, it was one scene of, of women that weren't saying nothing. It was just completely silent, silent. And honestly, with those those two women that was completely silent, I truly believe that they believed what the barber was talk, saying, but they just didn't want to say nothing at the time. And then they hopped on board with the, you know, it's, it's wrong train when the, all the cameras came out. So we're going to skip them. You know, we'll, we already talked about them a little bit, but they're not worth talking about. There was three other people that really did speak up. Um, there was a woman, a man. Well, it was two women and one man. And the man really said the truest words when the woman saying that an interracial relationship is was destroying the black family. I never heard stupider words in my life. You know, and what the man said in the video in that episode was, was it couldn't get no more truer. You know, what's destroying the black community is poverty, drugs, violence. Not that white woman dating a black man. That's not destroying anything. Okay? That's just two people falling in love and wanting to be with each other. And I just don't know why people just can't accept that, you know? Why does it got to be underlying a reason for why they, why they want to be together? I've heard it all. I've heard from a, a relationship specialist. You know, I heard from, you know, of why they think black men want to be with white women. And all those reasons are dumb to me. Now, am I saying that all black women, you know what I'm saying? I mean, not all black women, but all black men date white women just out of love? No. I mean, that's obviously not true neither. You know what I mean? There's some ignorant-ass black dudes out there that feel a certain kind of way about black women. Yes. And that's... Ignorant type, ignorant black women that feel a certain way about black men. There's ignorant people all, of all, all kind of different skin colors. <laughs> Everywhere, you know. So, what I'm saying is, let's stop being ignorant. You know what I mean? Let let people love people and stop trying to have an opinion about it. We don't have to have an opinion about every single thing. We don't have to vote for every single relationship. All right. That's pretty much all I have on that subject. Uh, you know. All feedback is welcome. Let's talk about it. I think the the episode of what would you what would you do was pretty interesting. And it was pretty refreshing to be honest, especially the woman at the end with the the hugs hugs uh, reference. You know, so uh, check it out. Holler back at me what you think of this video. Thank you.